Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. So now we are in Bali and I'm running late. We have a little dinner cruise, so I'm gonna bring you with me. I got this little dress though, and it's super cute. Let me show you in the mirror before I walk out. I am obsessed with it, but okay. They're waiting on me, so I have to go. Oh, Hello, you guys. Look at our ways. They're so cute. Um, we're waiting for dinner. We're going on a dinner cruise. I'm so excited. I'm really hungry. But we're having so much fun. Hello. Bye. <laughs> Hello you guys, good morning. So yesterday we went on that dinner cruise and I took like a bunch of clips. Today, okay, so it's 5.55 in the morning and we have a like snorkeling and island tour um, that starts at 6.30 and I have to be downstairs in like five minutes to catch the bus that's gonna go. We're all gonna go, but like since it's a group tour, I don't know how many clips I'm gonna get because I don't really feel comfortable like in large groups of strangers whipping out my camera and filming. But um, so I have like the itinerary pulled up so I can like explain to you what we're doing in case you like want to book these things if you come to Bali. But um last night we did the bali high sunset dinner cruise it was like dinner and a show it was pretty cool today we're doing the noosa panita snorkeling with manta bay and island tour i personally think that these times are very early like i am low-key dying and then we fly home well home we fly back to manila um at 8 45 a.m on thursday so it's just like a really busy chaotic kind of trip um this is what we did in shargao like we were there three days and we had like an event every day and then flew home so like we're really maximizing our time here i'm just like so tired but i'm gonna go ahead and get dressed and i'm gonna take you along with me and film as much as i can maybe some clips on my phone with a voiceover just so that i'm not like being obnoxious filming myself in front of strangers but i gotta get going <laughs> Hello, we finally made it off of the boat. That was like such a long boat ride. Some kid vomited next to me. It was so gross. But um, I think this tour is going until 5 p.m. So we're just gonna be doing a lot of stuff. But it's really pretty here. Look at the ocean. I love it. I have my equipment and we're about to go on the boat. I got water in my mask. I got chicken satay. So now I'm going to try 
try the curry. It's it's okay. It's pretty good. It's kind of cold. Okay, you guys, we finished eating lunch. Um, it was kind of bad. But our tour guide brought us to this area to look at the view. So here's the view. I'm just gonna stay here. Yeah, I saw the view. It's pretty cool. Are you happy to be in Bali? Of course. <laughs> Okay vlog, that was the last stop on our tour. Thank God, I'm exhausted, but we had a lot of fun. I got this ice cream. Um, it's a paleta. I thought this was like a Mexican thing. It's good. Hello vlog, so today is our last full day in Bali. Um, I feel like it's kind of loud by the waterfall. Okay, today's our last full day in Bali and we just ate breakfast, we sat by the pool, it was super nice. Um, I'm wearing a little bikini, so I'm gonna take some pictures at their pool. The pool is really cute, let me show you. There we go. I'm thinking that corner might have some good lighting but yeah today's our last full day um I, I didn't really take that many clips i kind of forgot i'm like pretty tired to be honest but um i'm gonna give my mom the camera and we're gonna we're gonna make something happen you know okay you guys so we went up to the fifth floor so they have like a little rooftop sky deck thing um there's a jacuzzi it's literally like that's literally all it is so it's not really it's not really anything revolutionary or groundbreaking, but yeah, the hotel we're staying at is called Horizon Seminyak in Bali. It's like kind of in the middle of all the touristy stuff. I would recommend it. The food is like, eh, it's okay. I will say like in Bali, I have been having some digestive issues. Like my stomach has been hurting. So if you are an American and you come here, be prepared, maybe bring like some Pepto or something, but yeah, here it is. And then they have some showers, and that's all. Okay, we are chilling by the pool, and we decided that we were gonna order some food, so this is the menu in case y'all want to stay here, but they have these drinks. Um, where's the cocktails? I think I want a cocktail. They have a bunch of stuff and then here's the food some of the food is like a miss for me um a lot of it kind of hurts my stomach i am gluten free so that does make traveling really difficult but um i'm gonna find something to eat and i'll show y'all when the food comes out here's our drink okay i have a hazelnut espresso martini cheers mom Cheers. Cheers. Let's try it. How do you like it? I like it. This is really good too. This is delicious. This is better than some of the food I've had here. 10 out of 10. Okay. Then we got the Bali Blue. This is really good too, but it tastes weird after having like the coffee drink, but I really like it. Okay, we have our food. So we have some spring rolls and the lumpia. Oh. 
Okay, you guys, we are on drink number two. I got a blue lagoon, and then this is like the purple breeze, so we're gonna try them. Honestly, the drinks here are really affordable. It's 120K rupia, which is like $8. I'm from Austin, cocktails are like $15, $20, so like this is very nice. This one's kind of strong. It tastes like Sprite. I like it. So the Blue Lagoon, I would give that like an eight out of 10. Now let's try the Purple Breeze. I like the purple one. This one's like sweeter. Okay. Okay, we finally made it back to the hotel. So basically here's our overview of the day. Breakfast. I took pictures at the pool right down there and then we walked around and did some shopping so i'm going to show you everything we got while we were shopping in bali just like at the little street vendor you know that type of that type of place um and then uh yeah so after shopping my mom and i ate i had like some drinks some food i'm like kind of full and tired but now we're going to the beach and also, if you didn't know, the sun sets in Bali at like 6, 6.30, which is like absurd because in Texas, during daylight savings, or like after daylight savings, the sun sets at like 8.30. So like the fact that we only get limited sunlight here is odd. Let's start with uh, some of the like touristy items. So I got the green bucket hat that I was wearing earlier. I just think it's a vibe. It's like so cute because I have a green bikini that I'm gonna wear to the beach. So like, we're gonna like color coordinate. But um, I also got a blue one just to like give to like a friend or something. The green one's better. I like the green one. But um, yeah, that and then I got a hat for my boyfriend. Surprise, surprise, I have a boyfriend. He wears a lot of like backwards hats, I don't know but I got this for him. And then uh, we got a tan bucket hat as a souvenir for another friend. Okay, those are all of the hats. And then, um, ooh, okay, next. I'm so excited for this because I've always wanted one of these, but I'm not paying a thousand dollars for like a bag like this. But here's my Goyard tote that I got in Bali. I think I wanna bring this with me when we go to the beach just think it's a cute little bag and this ended up being like 30 us dollars and honestly it looks pretty good like i i looked at it and the stitching and everything like i'm actually i'm i'm like very happy with it like i think it's so cute i wanted to get like multiple of the mini size but it was hard to find because we were like wandering the streets of Bali because the first night that we were here, I saw the bag and then I was like, oh, I don't want to like get it right now. Like maybe I'll find a better one. But then I was like, actually, I want to buy it and it's our last full day here. So then we were like walking around for like two hours trying to find it. So cute and tiny and little and they both come with like this little thing. Honestly, like I would say it looks pretty legit. Like again i've never seen a real one but who cares because i was thinking of using this when i go to solid core because that's what my friend uses hers for she like puts her little stuff in there and throws it on the floor so like i'm not throwing a bag that's like 1500 dollars on the ground like this was 30 bucks so look it matches i love color coordination and i love bali um maybe the food is not the best the food the food i got at lunch was good um, but the food the other two days was not that good and then also for some reason my aunt my mom and I have all been going to the bathroom very frequently here okay anyway the very last thing that I got in Bali was um, actually no I bought more stuff I think my mom oh yeah here's the last designer item that I got it's so cute it was only 30 US dollars oh my god like it's so pretty like i asked one of my friends and she said the only thing that looks off is this but come on like i'll just take that off who cares because like i'll use it when i go out at night if i go to the bars you know with my little tight mini dress i'll have this and it's so sparkly and cute but 
I love her. She's so adorable. Okay, um, they also have a bunch of these little Birkenstocks. These are like 10 US dollars. You kind of have to barter my mom. My mom is from the Philippines, so like she can barter, but I'm I'm not into bartering, so I'm just like, mom, like go ahead, get me the best price, whatever. But I'm gonna wear these when we go to the beach um, in a couple minutes because this matches my other bikini. So um, because we have limited time in each country, we're doing about like three, four days in each country. So we did three days in Chargao, three days in Bali. We're gonna do like maybe three or four days in Korea and then three or four days in Japan. Um, I'm gonna like change swimsuits in case I wanna take more pictures of the beach so it can look like it's different days. But um, that's pretty much everything I have to show you guys. What is, oh, here's my little shirt that I got. Look how cute this is. I got it in a 2XL and the man was like, why do you want that big of a size? Like, why is it for you? Like, who's it for? And then my mom was like, just give her the 2XL, like shut up. But um, yeah, it just says, what does it say? Surf Bali. This was like 10 US dollars and then look, it has that on the back. So um, I'm very, very pleased with my souvenirs. And then I'm gonna vlog at the beach. Uh, the pool is like pretty cute, let me show you. So this is the view from my room. And the staff at this hotel is really nice. So I'd recommend staying here. Um, just be careful ordering the food. Probably be careful with what water you drink. Maybe do bottled water. I made it to the beach. I'm so happy, here it is. It low-key looks the same as the beaches in Florida and everywhere else I've visited, but I don't know, it's in Bali, so that's pretty cool. Here you go. It's my lovely family. guys i'm back um tonight is our last night in bali so we're going to be eating dinner at this greek restaurant i think it's called santorini which is super random that that's in bali but like i the indonesian food is like not agreeing with my stomach neither is the water and my family members are having the same experience as me so we're gonna eat dinner there i like the ambiance it's giving you know greece blues whites really pretty um but i also just got a massage at i think it's called blue coconut spa um i got a massage and i got a body scrub i personally was not a fan of the body scrub because the water wasn't hot enough i was freezing the whole time but the massage was like pretty good i think everything came out to like 20 us dollars so i can't really complain because it was pretty cheap but um here's my outfit for dinner so i got another one of these dresses i had the blue one on um the first night that i was here and now i'm wearing the green honestly in the hotel lighting it looks very similar to the blue one but i promise it's a different dress um and this was like super cheap too especially if um you have a parent like mine who will barter but that is it so i will see you guys when we get to the restaurant <music> 